Hey YouTube, Tech for Time here, and today I'll be starting a new series where I'll be doing my top tweaks from Cydia, jailbreak tweaks, and I'll be doing hopefully episodes every week. So I'll have about five tweaks per episode, and this will be the first one. Okay, starting off with tweak number one, it's called Flux. There it is F dot L U X. So when you go into when you download Flux off Cydia, you get this app. It's downloads to your home screen, Flux app. And basically what Flux is is at night time, if you know when you're using your phone at night time and the screen is too bright, even if your brightness is at the bottom, Flux can will change that. See if I click enable Flux here. I don't know if you can see this, but the screen goes like screen got really yellow and you can change the brightness of the screen to candlelit. It's really cool but I don't know if you can see this on my screen recorder but actually I'll take a screenshot for you to show you what it's like. So then yeah so basically Flux will change your screen to this nice yellowy kind of light and it makes it real not it doesn't strain your eyes at night time and you can disable it and enable it when you want and it will automatically come on at night time. Second tweak today is Byte SMS. You get this off Cydia, you get a Byte SMS app, and all your SMSs will come up in that. But the main reason I use it is for the lock screen. I'm just going to lock my phone now. I'll also text to it. Just going to lock my phone now. So that message comes in. And it comes up on the home screen in this little box here. It's handy because you can choose close in the top to close it. Later to do stuff later with it. You can go back and call the person, open the whole text, or simply reply, which I usually do, which is handiest. You can just reply from there or whatever. You can bring this down and see the previous. There's no previous text with this, but the previous messages. You can just open it in the app. Yeah, you know my code now. And then... There's everything from the app. It's, it's handy for the, the lock screen when the text comes up. Okay, my third tweet today is five icon dock. And it's to do with these apps down here. You can add five, you can put five of them in that. Let me show you now. There's four like you usually have and you can squeeze a fifth one in there. This is simple but it's handy if you like having if there's more apps that you constantly use and you just want to have them in there. So that's five in there. Okay, so my fourth tweak today is called Infinity Folders. And it basically means you can your folders are infinite. Like there's I know there's a limit of I don't know, maybe twelve apps or less, could be less. And basically your folders can be infinite. If you like to keep it organized and maybe just have all the folders on one home page, this would be good because you can just have all the folders like with infinite apps. My fifth tweak today is called Lyricalizer. This is a I really like this tweak. It's it's smart and it's real handy. So what it is is when you're playing music in your music app, I can't start playing music now because of copyright and because my recorder will stop. So anyways, when you're playing music, if you tap the screen it will start loading lyrics if you're connected to the internet. So the lyrics will load if you can if you can find them off some server. And you can scroll through the lyrics while you listen to the song. The good thing about this is you need to you have to have Wi Fi for the lyrics to load. But when your Wi Fi is off it will still have the lyrics saved. So that's a pretty handy thing to have. So that's what it's called lyricalizer. Okay, so if you taught this Top tweak video was good. I'll hopefully be making more of these very soon. So if you like them, please give the video a like. Comment if you need any help with downloading apps or downloading the tweaks or anything if you have any problems. And remember to subscribe if you haven't already.